we're starting work in an old glass recycling plant today. The place was pretty neglected and abused. Six inches of ground up glass dust and crushed glass over every surface, over all the ceilings, the, the beams, the columns, the crane rails. So that's all been cleaned off now and we're going to start shortly sandblasting all the structural steel, brush blasting the decking, blasting the walls, the columns, in preparation of a high performance coating system that will give them a long life. There's going to be an automotive parts manufacturing facility moving in here, mainly injection molding. So they need an extremely clean facility. So we'll check back in later on. We're also going to be blasting and coating all the floors when we're finished. So it'll be quite the showpiece facility when we're done. Uh, the plant is roughly around 70,000 square feet. up all the ceiling and some of the top steel. Still got a lot of work left to do. Sandblasting is all finished. Unfortunately we couldn't take any videos of the sandblasting because you couldn't see uh, just too much black sand around. The uh, low bay on the side here is all done. All primed and top coated. Columns all yellow. And we should be another couple days in the main bay here. sandblasted this whole room out and primed up the ceiling. The steel was all blasted to SPS 6 and the decking on the ceiling and the uh, perimeter walls were brush blasted, commercial blasted. So the coating will last a long time. I couldn't take any pictures of here before because it was just too dark. You couldn't see anything. There's very few lights in here but uh, now that the ceiling's painted white you can actually see pretty well. Just finishing off the yellow details in the area and we're scrubbing the floors to get the dust off them so that when we shaw blast we don't clog up the machine. Uh, we expect to finish off the details on the painting by tomorrow and then we'll start blasting the floors and getting them ready.
the self-leveling urethane mortars going down now. Guys are spreading around with squeegees, then they broadcast sand out, and then roll it with spiked rollers to get the air out. It's going down at 3 sixteenths of an inch with an additional 30 mils of coating on top of that. A quarter of an inch broadcast system went down over the weekend in this section and now the guys are blowing off all the excess sand in preparation for the first coat of epoxy.